Hello everyone, it's Kendra here, Miss Kincaid. Thank you guys so much for tuning into my channel. So today I'm bringing you guys a brow video as requested. So if you guys would love to see how I went from this before to this after, then stay tuned. All right, you guys, I'm gonna start off by taking my spoolie and I'm just gonna use this spoolie and I believe it's an e.l.f. spoolie and it's very inexpensive. I'm gonna use it to just brush my brow hairs up Next, I'm going to take my Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Wiz in the color dark brown, and I'm just going to begin to outline the bottom of my brow. Basically, I'm using short strokes, and I'm just creating that outline at the bottom of my brow. Um, you guys, I never pluck or you know shape up my brows. I just let them grow the way that they're supposed to grow. I don't do anything else to them. So now I'm gonna take my spoolie and I'm gonna brush all my hairs down. And then I'm gonna do the same thing. I'm just gonna create a natural, whatever whatever shape my brows go in, I'm just going to fill it in. I'm not creating a whole new shape. I'm just basically filling in the sparse area. So I'm gonna to continue to create um, little hairs by using little small strokes using this Anastasia Brow Wiz. And I do like this because the tip is so thin that it just looks like hair. So now you just see me here brushing it all out, making sure everything is nice and natural looking. Um, and then I go back in with a black liner and I can't remember where I got this black liner from. It Everything has rubbed off on it, sorry guys. But you can use any black um, liner and I just fill in the tail because I like my tail to look quite dark. Um, darker, I like an ombre look. So basically I'm just filling in the tail of my brows just to uh, make sure it's darker. And I'm just gonna take that e.l.f. spoolie and I'm gonna brush everything in, blend it in, make sure it, it looks nice and natural. And now I'm gonna take my Anastasia Beverly Hills Clear Brow Gel. This is bomb.com. I used to use the tinted one, um, a dark brown tinted one, but I find that since I am filling in my brows with like darker liners, darker pencils, then I don't really need a tinted one. So this clear brow gel is right on time, honey. So I'm just gonna take that and I'm just gonna brush my brows in place. Any hairs that are out of place, I'm just gonna brush them in place. Um, and uh, I really, really love this brow gel because it makes my hairs pop out so they're not like it doesn't it makes everything look like it's hair instead of penciled in it just basically makes everything look so natural it just gives your brows like this extra boost of bomb.com <laughs> that's how I would explain it <laughs> so yeah and I also love to brush the front of my brows up you guys that just gives it a nice clean look so I'm gonna take my Anastasia Beverly Hills um, contour palette and I'm going to take this Vanity Planet brush and I'm just gonna sculpt out my brows now I really didn't have to do this I can stay um, keep it the way it was it just looks more natural but I wanted to give it an extra edge, nice and crispy, so I decided to go in with the concealer and then outline my brows. So keep in mind, like I said, I don't pluck or shave or shape up my brows. I may pluck a hair or two, just being lazy, and <laughs> so I may do that um, here or there, but most of the time I do not pluck my brows. So this concealer trick is bomb if you wanna conceal any hairs that are not you know, plucked or threaded um, underneath your brow. So like I said, I go with the shape of my brow. So I kind of sorta don't really have hairs because all of my hair is within the brow, if you know what I mean, if you understand that. So basically it's not a lot of hair out of my brows because I followed the shape and I've just you know, included all of the hair into the brow, basically. I do like to shape the top of my brow because it just gives it a nice sharp look. Like I said, I, I love the nice sharp look that the concealer gives. So here I am just um, outlining my brows and then I am gonna pluck you guys only because I'm lazy and there was one hair out of place that I just couldn't jab with. I should have actually cut that hair down, but since it was just annoying the crap out of me and I didn't have any scissors available, I'm just gonna pluck it right on out. So boink, there it goes. <laughs> Go, go, go. 
And here is a before and an after of my brows. I just love the way that they look. They look very natural. They look like they're full of hair and not quite penciled in, but they do look very natural. And of course, here is what it looks like with the full face of Beat. Um, so yes, you guys, please stay tuned because this hair and makeup will be coming up next. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know if you have any questions. Definitely post them in the comment section below. Please check the description box for all products mentioned. And I will talk to you guys on in my next video. Bye guys. Yeah. Huh, huh.